use three. I think I used two of these and one little cone to get down where the springs go at on the rear end. So I don't know. I got a got one somewhere. I just gotta look for it. So I just got these two. I went and bought me some ear muffs, man. Sometimes the noise don't be hurting my ear, but sometimes I be tired of hearing that noise and shit. I went and copied me some of them, man. So uh so we got on the frame, you two. I'm gonna sand this puppy down, man. Uh, I ain't tripping over it no more. But I, I got something else to show y'all too later though, man. When I fade back with y'all later though, about that chassis to paint, man. Oh, uh, we finna go and grind this thing down. We probably uh, I'm gonna see. I'm thinking about taking that front back down, but we will get back to that later. I'm um, probably start about right up in here somewhere. Maybe I might go all the right there and all the way to the back, baby. So uh, I'll fade back with y'all a little later. Yo, what up, YouTube? We faded back. It's Mr. Get In There. We got the frame sanded down, man. You know? Got it sanded down, man. That shit came out so quick, so easy. Fade on uh, YouTube. Man, it's ridiculous, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. So I just got, uh, I got to do the front and flip it over. So I guess like I could say I got it. 50% of it done, I guess. I'm gonna go and drop. I'm, I'm, I'm real trying to see if I'm gonna go home and leave them control arms and stuff on. Cause I don't feel like missing with them springs. But, uh, I got the, I got the spring compressor from my boy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I might go and take them back down. You know, cause I got the spring compressor and it, I hook it up real quick. It don't take long with that spring compressor, man. Uh, you use it right. I'm gonna show y'all how to use that right. A couple people don't know how to use that thing right. Like uh, like my boy Twin Siley. He, he he don't know how to use it right. I'm gonna show you. You got him in there, big homie. But I'm gonna show you how to use that thing right, man. Uh, well, Sean, I know you're gonna do your springs on, on 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 your on your old school. I'm gonna show you how to use that thing, man. It's a ball, Mr. Get in there. He got your back, man. But um, that's the front end suspension, man. He's just, just not checking in on the build. You know what I'm saying? Got the little boots on there, whatever, for the accent, you know, whatever. But I think I'm gonna go and strip that thing down, man. Go and take it down. Uh, what else? What else? That's about it, YouTube. We're gonna fade back, man, when I get it all stripped down. Oh, went to the paint store, man. Wanna holler at my people at the paint store. And got, uh, when it got me some shop line uh poxy prime, I went and got white. Um uh, put some pretty good stuff on uh, who else we use? My boy over there on uh my friend Pete over there, uh DIY Automotive School. Y'all check that channel out, man. All kind of helpful tips. He use it. He do good work over there. If he use it, I know it gotta be good enough for Mr. to get in there. So that's what I got. Uh, about uh, about forty bucks with the uh with the activator. About 40 bucks with the activator. That's what I got. So, uh, we're gonna fade back on um, a little later when we get all this stripped down, man. What up, YouTube? We faded back. Let's get in there. Uh, got that ring. I mean, the front end stripped down. Only took me about, uh, shit, about 15, 20 minutes, man. Everything dropped down nice and easy. Uh, got the front end. Got the front. Took all the way back down, man. Yeah, I went in and took it back down, man. I didn't feel like trying to tape it around the little control arms and all that crap. I just went and took them off, man. Uh, everything, like the springs have been comp compressed together already. Um, been bolted up for a good little while, so they should have been, you know, they should have uh, been a broke in a little bit. So everything should fall back nice and easy, man. But, uh, yeah, I just took everything, put it to the side. Put everything back on the on the right on the same side it came off of. Put the right side back on the right, left back on the left, the springs, everything. Just I left all the linkage and stuff hooked together. But uh that's what we got YouTube. Um fade back with y'all a little later, man, when I uh get this frame this frame stripped down over now. Yo, what up YouTube? We faded back. Just keeping y'all updated, man, you know. Showing that boy is getting it in, man. He grinding, man. I gotta get this done, man. I gotta get it done the right way, man. So, um. We'll 
fitting it in, man. I just gotta flip it. Uh, I ain't hit this. That shit, that clear was pretty thick, boy. Up here in the front, I remember that too. Up here in the front, I remember that's where you are gonna see when you pop the engine hood or looking between the wheel wheel. Boy, I had that clear thick up here in the front, boy. Woo woo! I should have left it alone, but up in here, flicking right off. Uh, some spots, but I know from from about right here on. Ooh, it was thick, boy. Uh, just got to flip it. I guess we could say we got about 75% of the frame done now. I guess we got uh, three sides. Here. Here. But all we got to do is the bottom side, man. We're going to be done, man. Probably take the car wall, wash it down. Wash it down and uh, what else? What else? Uh, wash it down. Probably hit it with that 180. Scratch it up with that 180 so that... Um, Poxy Prime gonna stick good to it. I'm thinking about yeah, I know what I'm talking about. I know what I'm I jumped off. I didn't get this that good. I'm gonna come back with the grind and get this. I think I'm gonna weld them, weld all them holes shut, man. I think I'm gonna weld all them holes shut, man. Give it a little more cleaner look, man, you know. And, you know, probably won't be seen to you, but that's what I'm gonna do, though, man. Uh, I'm gonna see, though. If I can get him to catch, if I can get it to catch good, it gonna close up. I'm gonna see what up. Uh, what else, what else? That's it, man. We're gonna take a car wall, wash it off. We're gonna throw it on the back of the trailer, man. Finna, finna, see, I'm catch up with somebody, man. Help me flip this sucker, man. And, uh, I will flip it by myself, but I, but I notched the wheel wheels and it's kind of flimsy back there, so I don't want to bend nothing back there. So, uh, I think last time I flipped it myself. Uh, but, uh, that's it, YouTube. Uh, fade your back when we get it flipped, man. Probably when we get it flipped and get it all washed up, man. Fade your back. Yo, what up, YouTube? This your boy, checking in, faded back in. Been getting it in on the cutty all day. Uh, been grinding it down, man. Uh, hit it with that wire wheel. Uh, wasn't too bad. Came out pretty good, pretty easy. Just flaking right on off, man. Uh, came out pretty good, man. Uh, got the front all stripped down, man. Uh, got all that. All I gotta do is flip it, man. Any other time, everybody and their mama hanging around. Ain't nobody around right now for me to flip it. For me to get the bottom half. So, uh, so I'll flip it tomorrow. I'm gonna shut it down, man. Go chill out, man. I don't know. Might get it in tonight. I don't know. Uh, but uh, that's what we got, though, YouTube. Uh, I, the back, all the way to. From the back. All the way to I think that that mount right there, I started hitting it with the uh, with the 180 grit. Uh, that's what the uh, that's what the prep sheet say on the uh, on the on the epoxy man. Uh, got to get the tech sheet man. See uh, goddamn uh, to say man ain't got no tech sheet man. So saying 120 to 180 grit on bare metal. That's gonna help that uh, epoxy stick. Uh, so I had some some uh, 180 grit left. So I gotta go get some more. I might just see if I go get a uh, a red. Uh, no, that ain't gonna work. That ain't gonna work. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna go get some more sandpaper. Cause like I said, I stopped about about right there. I gotta do the front and uh, flip it. So I'll probably get it all finished up tomorrow. I'm hoping I can get two people to come help me flip it today. And uh, that way in the morning, I can go ahead and hit that last side, and then I come back and uh, sand, sand it. Well, I'm a, well, I need to sand it before I flip it. It don't matter. I'm, I need to get it flipped though, so I'ma see. Uh, I need to get somebody to help me pick this up, move this, put this in the corner back there. Uh, that's it though, YouTube. We, we been getting it in, man. Oh damn! Oh, uh, oh yeah. That's what I got. got. I just got that from my boy this morning. That's the uh, that's the frame. That's the shot. Uh, I say frame. The spring compressor. That's the spring compressor that I use. It worked good. You use it right. It worked good. Uh, Schaefer, Sean. This that's this this this, this, this what you need right here. That other one you bought, I, I ain't too sure. I'm not gonna say it won't work. 
I'm not sure. I know this works. What you gotta do is uh I show y'all in the video tomorrow. But I got another video showing how you install it. I mean how you grab the spring. You can't put this at the bottom because you're gonna jam it. You got to go up maybe like two cars or maybe three cars. Then you grab it. Maybe two or three from the top. Then you squeeze it down till it max out. That allow you to put it in, put it up, and get maybe a couple threads started on the upper control arm. And it's hold. Then you got to reposition it. And then bring it up. Maybe about five cars from the bottom. Maybe five from the top. And you compress it some more. You got you to gotta, you gotta grab it a second time. But to get it close enough for it allow you to tighten up go on bolt up the, uh, the upper ball joint because uh I installed mines with the with the bottom with the with the bottom uh ball joint I already bolted up to the spring all I gotta do is tighten up the top but uh well I I I sh I'll show y'all tomorrow man uh tomorrow man uh on how that goes and so you can physically see it you know and then me trying to explain it but uh that's what you need right here AutoZone, AutoZone use, I mean AutoZone rent them. Uh, my boy, he been had that, we been using that, sharing that back and forth. Uh, that work, I know that for a fact, that work. Uh, so uh, that's it, YouTube, man. Uh, that's it, man. Uh, keep it locked, man. Uh, what else, what else? That's it, man. That's it, man, YouTube. Uh, Mr. Get in there over and out.